Hello, this is Allison Rapp, and today is day 30 of our video challenge to help you get more Feldenkrais clients and have the practice you want. Today, I want to talk to you a little bit about collaboration, which we discussed briefly yesterday, and why when you collaborate with colleagues in the Feldenkrais community, it's better to tell the truth than it is to try to do the thing that we call fake it till you make it. People will figure out pretty quickly if you're not being yourself and if you're hiding something. So I figure that it's better that if I've got a skill that I need to develop or I need more experience or even just that I'm not as confident as I would like to be and need to build my confidence, that I let people know about that. And also that if I need different clients than the ones I'm working with or more clients, that it's better to have a plan about how to get that and then work on it every day than it is to try and pretend that I'm something I'm not. And you know the funny thing about this is that what I've discovered in my own practice is that when I tell that kind of truth to myself, I make myself really attractive to my clients and they can find me much more easily. I become visible because I'm telling the truth. It's a funny thing, but it seems like what happens is that people want to hear people tell the truth People want to have an authentic relationship with people, but for the most part, that's not what we get. And people don't tell the truth most of the time. So when people find somebody who does tell the truth, it's incredibly magnetic. The other thing about it is that you will repel certain people, and that saves you a boatload of time because you don't have to worry about getting them as clients. Thanks so much for coming, and I look forward to seeing you here again tomorrow. Bye-bye.